How's it going, everyone? Welcome to Bioshock 2. A couple months ago, we had beaten and completed Bioshock the first, so we'll move on to this one. I said I would probably get to the second one at some point. And even though they're not completely uploaded yet, Prototype, Sniper Elite, and Resident Evil Operation Raccoon City are all completed and very close to being uploaded in full. I believe today, which is Saturday, which might actually be the day this goes up, because I had something else I wanted to upload today, but it ended up taking a little bit longer to do and got split into two different videos and will be uploaded Sunday, so I need something to kind of take the place. First episode of this might go up and there's a fucking cutscene, but, um, yeah, there you go. I'm going to have to do this instead, which isn't a bad thing, but those three things are done um, as for other co-op stuff, some of it is out of my hands. Fallout New Vegas is also almost done. There's one DLC and the end game to go, and Kingdom of Amalur will never be completed because it's such a long fucking game. I was a little bit disappointed to know that this does not have controller support, even though I'm playing on the PC. Kind of sucks the first game did, and this one didn't. Looked it up, figured out why it didn't, and we move on. So, there might be a little bit of, I guess, bumbling around with controls, since I'm not exactly used to Bioshock controls on the keyboard, but we shall see what happens. 1958, I can skip this cutscene, but I don't want to, because I don't remember ever playing this game. Though I did, I just don't remember it. I remember this game was kind of crapped on by people, because it wasn't as good as the first, but... I'll need my memory jarred at this point. I don't remember this at all. I played the first and second one pre-YouTube and haven't recorded them, so... You know, within five years or so, four or five years, I think you're gonna lose some of the knowledge you had or memories of it. Look, Daddy! It's you! Let's go out to play, Daddy! Boy, I needed to look into the reflection to see that I'm a big daddy. Maybe you haven't played the first one, and you wouldn't know. Maybe you just need a little bit of a reminder. That is one big-ass needle. Alright. Yeah, you just take whatever goo they have inside them. Ew! That's fucking disgusting. Now I'm getting sent messages. Damn you! Deagle guy. Bald eagle. I always think of a gun for some reason. That was disgusting. And this is extra different. <gasps> that guy is extra drunk, isn't he? Uh oh! But I think that guy's head smashing. How the hell did she get down there so quick? Guy's got a couple plasmids. I always like when people talk shit and there then get killed. He's perfectly safe now. It's just funny. This is not your daughter. Do you understand? Her name is Eleanor, and she is mine. Now, kneel, please. Remove your helmet. Take the pistol. Place it against your head. Fire. Oh, suicide, or presumably so. See how that all ends up. Oh, it's Bioshock 2. Everything looks a little bit more, uh, barnacle-y than before. I honestly need a complete memory rejarring. Ten years later! Body's still there and that's the end of the game. 
Welcome to Cutscene the Game, which is actually just Heavy Rain or uh, The Walking Dead game. It's pretty much Cutscene the Game. Where we rescued. Oh, it's Tenenbaum. Hello, can you hear me? I get to be the big daddy. Awesome. I get to fucking drill people and shit. Which is great. At least they'll give me a little bit of a tutorial here. I mean, I can understand the basics and whatnot of what needs to be done. I can swing, I can drill. Alright. But uh, as for the finer points, such as uh, plasmid switching and whatnot, that. Ah, that's a little sister. Get out of there, you fucking bitch! Come on. Miss Madam. I just saw you in the goddamn them. As for that stuff, that's gonna take uh, a little bit. Get the hell out of here, Coral. Coral! What does this look like? Oh, Crouch is the big daddy, alright. There she is! Oh, it was. Alright, tutorial section. Whoa, it's a fucking big sister. It's one of them. I hate them. I remember them. They sucked. And by sucked, I mean they beat my ass and I don't like them. That's why I think they suck. Was this high voltage? Wow. Why would that. Ooh. Already a fucking diary. How about that? And then you have to. L. Hit L for the fucking diary. Alright. Lesson one, mob jockeys. You are under the ocean now. If you feel the soft patter of rain on your hat, you're already fired. Lesson two. You can jumpstart a dead generator with a direct spark, but clear the guests out of the pool first. Scares these rich pricks to watch a working stiff hurling thunderbolts. You follow me? Alright, well, sweet, uh... Oh man, a first aid kit. I gotta hit Kataro. Hit the old control button to use that. Hopefully I don't forget that, but I would've... An I did... Oh, never mind. <laughs> that says Eve. If I wasn't retarded and knew the difference between a U and a V, good lord. Or, not a U, and a Y. If I knew my alphabet, good lord. This is already starting off terribly. I know my alphabet. I know it starts with an A and ends with a 7. Some sort of number. Alright, what does this do? I can't even do... Hmm, what is that? Electro bolt, eh? Hmm. Yeah, let's go ahead and extract that shit. Oh, look, we have a little hole to... We're gonna stab ourselves. There you go. And now I just passed out again. Kind of. That's extra violent. Not so violent as uh, ex an extreme reaction to that. There's another little sister here. For such a long time, and Eleanor has missed you. Find her and you'll be all better. Yeah, that wasn't sudden or random. Now I have to fire the stupid thing. That's right, this actually introduced the... Ew. The fuck happened in here? I don't even think I want to know. This introduced the amazing ability to have a plasmid and a weapon and use them at the same time. There's gotta be something up here. Are kidding me? There's nothing up there? So that was a cool little introduction they, they uh, added in. Please hurry, daddy. Um... Why it was cool, it made things much more smooth and streamlined. And look, dollars! I have eleven dollars. Holy shit, that's pretty re that's pretty rich for I don't even remember what year it is. Is it the sixties now? Cause I think we were in nineteen fifty-eight or so, and then it was like, oh, now you're back or forward ten years, so go electro bolts. Alright, take one of those Eve hypos. I don't even know how to use it. Oh, you'll automatically Fucking yeah, there you go. What's this? Wow, thuggish splicers rely on brute force. Thank you. Let me go back. I really don't want to know about the finer points of them. Look at this guy. Shock an enemy and then quickly attack for critical damage. Ugh! Asshole. Oh look, it's another one. Let's do another swing. Jerk. What is this? What can I do? Hmm. Let me go ahead and shot. Oh look at that! 
the generator's going. What it does, I'm not exactly sure, but I can eat this potted meat, or, yeah, potted meat. What the hell is potted meat? Lamb is watching. <sighs> At last, a signal. You, who are bringing this dead city to life, listen. My name, it is Tannenbaum. I know who you are, and I am in much need of your help. Please. Find me in the Atlantic Express train station. All right, we'll do. Do I get? Oh, I get an arrow. Look at that. They actually give me an arrow. Sweet. I guess we need to go here. Check my map. I can get hints for the activity and go. I'm going in the dame's bathroom. Whoa! It's controversial because it's the '60s. I'm gonna be in trouble. To my daughter, Eleanor. Soon you will be born. And Rapture will be your home. You shall be raised as I was, to advance the common good through social psychiatry. This city's potential is immeasurable, Eleanor. Yet our beliefs are unwelcome here. Life will be difficult, but the price of revolution is always dear. If we are patient with her, Rapture will come to us. Yeah, I'm sure that'll happen. Anyway, the boys' bathroom was locked, and it looked like uh, the Fallout guy. This is Dr. Vault Boy. Lamb, with a message for the people. Remember, you are not alone. Think of me not as leader, but as mother to the Rapture family. Okay, well, thanks for that uh, public announcement. What is this? Random book. I'm trying to check, like, all the corners so I can see everything, but now I'm just getting a bunch of audio logs and I have to shut up for them. I am back in the Rapture after so many years. The little ones I rescued are grown up and think of me no more. After what I once did to them, it was a joy to be forgotten. But now, all around the world, children vanish by the sea, kidnapped. And so I return, in fear of what I already know. Someone is making new little ones, continuing my work, my sins. Even if I am to die for it, I must stop them. I think this might be the least amount of commentary I'll ever have given in a game because there's another fucking audio thing over there. So this is basically just gonna be like, listen to me give useless observations as you mostly listen to random dialogue and audio things. I'm sure some people will be like, well, what's the difference between the useless dialogue you usually give? Well, fuck you too, buddy. Here, have another fucking audio log. Barely made it down alive. But here it is. 